Yo, 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 what's going on, man? My name is Kyber Montero, man. I'm the CEO and president of Frequency Canvas LLC. And I'm also an award-winning master engineer with the company, man. I, I had somebody inquire uh, with our company very recently, and they asked me a question, and they said, Kyron, what is the difference between me just going to the recording studio and having my recording engineer, or as we as in, in the audio community say, tracking engineer, What's the difference between going and paying, you know, the two, three hourly rate and having my tracking engineer mix and master the song versus, you know, recording the song and then paying all this extra money for the mix and the master for a company like Frequency Canvas and for you to do it? That's a great question, man. So I want to talk to y'all real quick about the recording studio versus the audio production company. Let me say that again. A recording studio versus the audio production company. Now, I just got to throw in the shameless plug real quick. During the month of September and October 2024, we are offering all clients a free master for every single mix that is booked through our company here at Frequency Canvas. You should get on that. We're talking about award-winning sound, recognized on a national level for free for every single mix that you as an independent artist or record label book. Rather, it's a two-track mix or a full stem mix, you should definitely come check it out, man. Uh, Two-track mixes are 300 per mix, full stem mastering is 500 per mix. You get a free master, which is $150 value per master or per song. You should definitely check it out. So let's dive back in. Recording studio versus audio production company. First off, let me say this. Both companies, both kind of businesses are very similar in the sense they on paper they can almost look the same. A recording studio can offer mix and mastering an audio production company that zeroes in on mix and services and or mastering services can also offer recording services if they choose to. Most don't though. Um, but if you look historically kind of more in the recent era of the music industry, especially for genres like hip hop, uh, R&B, pop, a lot of independent artists and a lot of independent record labels who are going to studios in their local area. You, you know, most recording studios have, it's just different. You know, they have mic lockers with mic, you know, 50 to 100 to 200 microphones and they have live rooms where uh, bands can go in and, you know, get the natural reverb of the rooms and uh, they have big consoles, you know, uh, that allow you know, the full production to be recorded through these real high-end microphone preamps. And also the business model is typically an hourly model. Now, you can book a recording studio at a day rate, half day rate, uh, with things like that. They may, some may offer bundled deals, but for the most part, when it comes to a recording studio, it's gonna be an hourly rate. Here's what, I, and, and well, a lot of people are not gonna tell you this, but, in those studios, a lot of tracking engineers may not, but the truth of the matter is, is when you go to a recording studio and you book your two hours, what should happen is you should exhaust all of that time to make as great of a song as you can in the recording process. So if you go on, you know, let's say for a rapper, you go in the studio, you record a song for, you know, you book a two hour session, you record a song in 30 minutes. Of course, you want that other hour and a half to either be, to be spent on the, on the midst of the song and the mastering. But especially if you get full stems, meaning you have the individual files of the music plus all your vocals, it's gonna take more than an hour and a half to properly mix and master that song. Uh, also, it's a different skill set. Tracking, if an engineer has the fundamentals of audio, they can pretty much be a, a pretty good tracking engineer. As long as they pay attention, they know how to communicate with the artists, they know how to be professional. You know, I'm not gonna say anybody can be a tracking engineer, but there's so many people who can be tracking engineers that cannot be mixing and master engineers because not only does being a mixing engineer or a master engineer, not only does it, it take you to learn the fundamentals of audio engineering and audio production and you having to know the equipment and all of that stuff, um, it also takes an ear, which is production value, which is creativity, which comes in meaning experience. It takes an ear. Everybody can't have an ear. Everybody doesn't have an ear. So, you know, I don't, like I said, I'm not trying to say anybody can record, but there's so many people that, who are great recording engineers that do not have that, that next level ability 
to be able to take those records where they need to. Also, too, when it comes to audio production companies like Frequency Canvas and others like that may offer higher mental services and or master, sometimes we may put more, all of our time is, is in mission or master, right? So that means you're gonna develop some chops, you're gonna develop some experience and some expertise in this field specifically um, that's gonna be greater. You can have a heart surgeon, you can have a brain surgeon. Both of them are doctors, but both of them have put their, their time and attention and expertise in two different areas. So if I have a heart problem, I'm going to a brain, do a, a heart doctor. I'm not going to the brain doctor for a heart problem. Uh, and so a lot of times the plugins, the heart, the, the equipment in the studio, the way it's set up, it's more, it's more focused and detailed uh, for mixing and mastering. So, if you go to a recording studio, I'm not saying that those guys who work in that recording studio can't mix and or master records at a high level. I'm not saying that, but typically somebody like myself and our audio production company, Frequency Canvas, that have spent, you know, decades in working specifically on mastering services and or mixing services, uh, more than likely are gonna be able to do it at a high level, which is gonna cost you. Also, one more thing, even though it costs more, most audio production companies like Frequency Canvas are offering a flat rate, either per song or per project, which is kind of the same thing. Um, and that gives you the surety as the client to know that you don't have to spend no more money. You know what you're paying, right? So if you're going off the hourly recording rate model, it you only have what you can afford. If you can only afford three hours, then that's all you get, right? But you know, what if the song needs seven, eight hours between mention and master? And you only can afford three. Now you know you either don't do it at all or you just settle for less at the end of the day. And so that's why at Frequency Canvas, man, we want to offer major label quality, high level industry quality at the affordable independent rate for independent artists, man. So if you want to be great, sound great, man. Make sure that y'all visit frequencycanvas.com. Email us office at frequencycanvas.com. Book online, frequencycanvas.com slash booking. Uh, or you can reach out on our business cell at 765-506-3380. You have any direct questions for me, email me, Kyron, at frequencycanvas.com. Check the description in this, in this video for details, man. You want to be great? Sound great, man. Welcome to the canvas, Frequency Canvas.